1850, a very cruel act was passed that made it legal for slaves who had run away from plantations to be hunted like animals because they simply wanted to be free. The neighbors were very unwelcoming and actually went to the state to have the charter of the university pulled because they did not want the Negro presence on such pristine and bucolic areas. The students had been here two weeks to a month before the neighbors realized the Negroes are there. The Harlem Renaissance was about the new Negro. It was about black expression. And there were Morgan faculty members as well as students who were central to that expression. As events in Vietnam spiraled out of control and anti-war protests swept college campuses across the nation, Jenkins canceled Morgan's annual ROTC Day activities just hours before they were to take place. Malcolm X debated a Morgan professor named August Meyer, integration versus black nationalism. A 28-year-old Zora Neale Hurston, who would become a noted anthropologist, earned her high school degree from the Morgan Academy. I think the founders would be quite amazed at the journey uh, that Morgan State University has embarked upon. Morgan has experienced phenomenal growth under the leadership of President Richardson, and we were looking for someone who could continue that momentum. David Wilson was that person. <laughs> 